This YouTuber is frying your kid's brain. Okay, we have to talk about Matthew Beam, the absolute worst Mr. Beast clone. This guy will fry your kid's brain worse than TikTok ever could. This face over here will be staring at you at night. It will be haunting your nightmares after this video. So if I had to describe Matthew Beam, it's basically Mr. Beast, but double his editing, double his cuts, have his personality, and then sell your soul to the algorithm YouTube gods, you know? Matthew Beam, the type of guy to throw his family into a volcano if it means an extra million views. His videos are so mind-numbingly YouTubified that it feels like he's a robot AI just designed to create the perfect algorithm-friendly content. So we're gonna be watching a couple of his videos here. I built a secret gaming room to hide from the police. Why are you hiding from the police, Matthew? Do you do drugs? Definitely cocaine. I built a secret gaming room to hide from my dad. I can instantly see the raid sponsorship or something. I don't know what's going on there. I built the secret gaming room to hide from my sister. Why are you hiding from everybody, dude? What is going on? I built a secret gaming room <laughs> to hide from my mom. Why? Okay. Who is Matthew Beam? And why does he keep building secret gaming rooms to hide from his family members and now the police? I'm building a hidden gaming room in public to hide from the police. And to show just how secret this room is, I've challenged the police to find me. Police. Hello? Matthew Beam. You know him, right? My brother, yes. Yeah, we gotta find him. We're gonna need you to come with us. Oh yeah, very real video there. Matthew Beam wanted in 64 states. He's actually an international criminal. Can I just say, like even the premise of the video is so stupid. Don't get me wrong, he's done some cool videos or whatever. He's really good at like building random things. Like he'll build a, a large SpongeBob or something. He makes things like come to life, which is sort of pretty cool. But some of these videos are just so stupid. Why would you ever need a secret gaming room to hide from the police? Also, this gaming room is absolutely not secret. It's just a flipping block over here. Oh my god. We're gonna need you to come with us. Right yeah, right now. Yes. So you're my partner, Dave. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. That's this sick. is crazy. Is this this is crazy. This room is actually massive, but it's disgusting in here. It smells bad. I this room is massive? That's the smallest flipping room I've ever. Okay. I thought it was you. I thought it was you. <laughs> and while the police are searching for me, we'll be turning this room into a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle themed gaming room. The police are never gonna find us in here. Well, now they are, now that you posted it on YouTube, buddy. <laughs> Listen, I know the content is fake. I know the content is like four kids or whatever. It's a little idea, but I feel like his inspiration has always been Mr. Beast over here. And Mr. Beast content, you know, while most of it is obviously four kids, but there's a lot of like older audience also watching him as well because his videos are sort of, anybody can sort of watch the videos and be entertained by it, like people of all ages. This type of shit, there ain't a soul above the age of eight watching this, other than me, of course. I can't believe I'm in a real police car right now. You know what? We can get some lights and sirens going. <laughs> We're gonna be on the lookout for Matthew Beam. He's issued us a challenge. Hello, police officers. I am currently inside of a crazy hidden gaming room. You are- Hello, police officers. I'm in a crazy gaming room. Like, there's two ways this can go. There's one that he actually hired all real police officers, meaning there's like 18 police officers over here who are spending the entire day on a Matthew Beam video rather than actually, I don't know, fighting crime out there, arresting legitimate criminals. Or or there's the option too. He's just impersonating like, I don't know, 18 officers here, which uh, I don't know if that's illegal. I don't know what's going on here. Probably acting is probably fine, but I really hope this is not real, you know? Hello, police officer. I am currently inside of a crazy hidden gaming room. You are never going to find me. You have until midnight to try though. Good luck. You're going to need it. I don't think you're ever gonna find me. We're gonna find Why, him. why do you have until midnight? Is he gonna set off a bomb, Matthew Beam? Are you, are you about to nuke the state of New York City? Jesus Christ. And we're gonna take him down. That's right, I've challenged the police to find me in any way possible, so I'm gonna have to do some pretty insane things to not get caught. And if they find me at the end of this video, I've agreed to give away $5,000. We're gonna start off by making a- My brain is going to explode, dude. How, how, do, how do people even process that much information? Like, I don't have the TikTok brain. This type of shit just gives me a seizure. I wanna dump dunk my head into a toilet and flush it because I just want to wash away whatever the fuck I just saw. Custom painting of the Ninja Turtles on that wall. Good thing I keep a paintbrush in my pocket. This Paint room is Ninja massive, Turtles by the, wall, the way. <laughs> start by drawing the outline so we can fill them with colors. This is actually looking incredible. Literally Paint has to bend down. My favorite thing right now. Painting? Hiding from the police. Sharon, tell me about the suspect we have here. He's definitely with Aaron and Noah. He's always wearing this. Yeah, he wears that every single day. Does he wash his clothes? He has like 50 of the same shirt. Oh. Do you have one of those shirts for maybe a dog? We can use a canine. 
I totally understand why his sister is so excited to unleash a canine police dog on him. If Matthew Beam was my brother, I'd probably just end it all, not gonna lie. <laughs> Dog is excited so to bite into Matthew's cheeks. This is gonna be the best game room ever. Can they go ahead and hold the door for me? Oh. Uh, look at all of this stuff we have in here. We have tons of LED lighting that we're gonna be hanging up and all kinds of other things to make this room epic. This is my favorite thing that we got. Oh, 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 oh. that's clean. Before There's we use it, we have to finish this room. Well, we better hurry up. <laughs> the cops are on their way. Yeah, yeah okay. So the, the concept is fine. You can you can build whatever secret gaming rooms. Like, he's a good YouTuber in, in the sense of, like, you know, he knows how to build a bunch of stuff. He knows how to plan stuff out, hire people to do what he wants and stuff. So that's good. It's just in this sort of genre, you need to have stakes always. Otherwise, the flipping two-year-olds are going to click off, right? You need some sort of story throughout the video. This is the most artificially inserted story ever. Why is the police even hunting you? There's, like, no reason for any of this. It's like, also, your gaming room isn't even hidden. Why would the police give a single shit? I just like, the stakes are not even real. I don't, I don't understand how anybody finds this entertaining at all. Is that a warehouse? Yeah, but he's always there. You can tell us where this warehouse is at? Yeah, I have a okay. key. I can let you guys in. We'll start there then. I'll check the north side. I'll check the south side. Most NPC police officers ever. I'll check the north side. Thanks, buddy. Hey, guys. I'm uh, Perry, CSPD, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. How are you, sir? Yeah, man, I need to know if you've seen this guy named Matthew Bean. I haven't seen him a week now. For yeah. a week? Yeah, he hasn't been in the office for about a week. What is that? No, what? Uh, nothing. Wait, 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 wait. I don't know the exact location, okay. but they've been giving me- Bro just caught you on, on the hub. Uh, what the hell's going on here, dude? Oh my God, I thought this was a kid-friendly channel over here. Why are you switching tabs, buddy? Next, we're gonna be adding an entire security room in here so we can monitor everything going on out there. I have the An entire idea. security <laughs> room. Take this dumpster and turn it into a security room. Step one. Bro, not even a single flipping person can fit there. What are you even on about? Like, I mean, I know this is like sort of high effort, but it's the lowest version of that high effort. Your room is so flipping small. It's not even tall enough for you, dude. Like, I mean, if you're gonna do it, do it right, buddy. Jesus. We have to remove all of this trash. Step two, we gotta jump in. Oh. I'm never watching TMNT ever again, dude. I can't believe we're gonna turn this trash can into a hidden room. Can you try to cut a little quieter because the police are looking for it? Uh... Is it actually snowing or is this artificially inserted in your studio or some shit? I wouldn't doubt it. At the police station, time to get you in shape. Oh my gosh. I'll show you how to do your hair. Okay. And then we'll get you looking like a real police officer. All right, let's do this. All right. Before starting the manhunt, the officers trained my sister Cheyenne to make sure she was ready to help find me. All right, Cheyenne. We're honored to make you an honor. Some dude is out here literally murdering the population and these officers are stuck up with a Matthew Beam video over here. Jesus Christ, man. Some poor woman is getting robbed right now <laughs> and is calling the police department, but nobody's answering because they're trying to find Matthew Beam's secret gaming room. <laughs> His team ratted him out. He's downtown. Downtown. We're going to have to send some units down there, so hold on just a second. Can all units respond to downtown area where we're going to be searching and finding Matthew Bean? All units from across the goddamn globe. We need to do this. We need to find Matthew Beam over here. He's a national security threat over here. What if he plays Fortnite in his goddamn gaming room, guys? Holy shit, we can't be having that. Oh, boy. Thank you. We have commander's approval. We are going to find him. The police officers started to spread out around the entire city to search and cover as much ground as possible. What we got is one of Matthew's shirts. It has a scent on it. Take a sniff of this, see what you think. Think we can find Matt? Sounds good, let's do it. I wonder what his shirt smells like. Probably got the drool, the dribble of all the five-year-olds. He probably stores them in a little jar, just like, this is the source of my power. <laughs> Different screens we're gonna be adding in our trash can so we can monitor everything going on on the outside. We have just five. put yourself in there, buddy. We actually have five. Yeah, I counted. <laughs> Let's get some rugs in here. That's a lot better. <sighs> Looks nice in here. Yeah. You guys look a little too close. Hey yo. I think there's room for one. Hey yo, Matthew We're Beam. To make the perimeter as small Kinda as we sus. can. Slowly, that perimeter is oh get tighter and tighter and tighter. Matthew, if he tries to run, he's gonna be surrounded. Looks like there's like some barrels and trash cans and stuff. He would definitely hide some of these. Now, I ain't saying anything, but if Matthew ever got outed as a certain thing, I would not be surprised at all. I'm just saying. We have a ton of wireless security cameras that we can set up all throughout the city and monitor in our security room. 
right there so we know where the police are at all times. You you will know where the police are at all times. How are you setting up these security cameras without the police ever like, and it was dumb as shit to question the logistics of this, but just for the sake of the video, you know, pretending all of this is real here, you were in one place and you're not moving. Even if you spot them on the security camera, what are you gonna do? Leave your secret gaming room? That's a fate worse than death, right? So I don't see how they're useful at all. The thing about this is we have to be very careful while we're setting up these cameras because the police are currently looking for us. So don't be suspicious. Hey, that's pretty much impossible for me, please. My handle is Gigasus. I, my name is Megasus. The sus is born within me and it dies within on. me. We started installing security cameras everywhere around our city in the area. What is this, incompetent police, bro? Imagine this dude was actually a criminal, bro. Matt, we're getting close, man. My dog's gonna find you. I think you better come out right now. You're getting ready to lose this game. The dog is sitting there, doing nothing. It's not being ravenous. There's no scent to follow. I doubt you even that and sniff the thing. We're getting close. We're gonna start splitting up, seeing we're checking some other corners. So if it's narcotics, he goes into a real rigid stand and stare. He'll just stare intently at it. If it's a person, once he identifies the odor, he'll watch for a second, and then he should start to aggress on it. He'll claw, he'll bark. I'm just gonna keep walking so he Wait, looks so it is real because they got an actual canine dog? I mean, what? What is going on here, bro? I'm a little confused. Did this dude actually occupy the police for an entire day? There ain't no way, bro. As soon as I push this button, this camera will be live. Now let's go look in the security room. This is actually crazy. I can see the entire street out there. Dude, that's insane. We now have two hidden rooms, the garbage security camera room and the room next to us. Notice how I didn't say gaming room. The least suspicious house ever here. Just a random flipping cube in the middle of nowhere with a conveniently placed trash can outside of it. Just, if I was playing hide and seek, this is the first place I'm checking, dog. And it's because we still have a lot of crazy amenities to add in here. And the next one is the insane tube slot. Can we play video why? Go down it. Normally, it'd be impossible to play video games going down a slide, but that's where the Lenovo Legion Go comes in. The of course, the sponsor got a sponsor. For today's video. You guys think the police are gonna see this? Yeah. yeah. We're gonna have to camouflage this, but first we're gonna install it. This is the support that How we'll are you gonna camouflage? Slide. The Legion Go what takes portable gaming to a whole new level. So if you wanna play games in a hidden gaming room or while going down an epic slide, this is for you. Ah, uh, yes. I, I personally want to play all my games in a hidden gaming room, for sure. I don't know why it's such a big keyword on YouTube, but this guy loves the secret gaming rooms, the hidden gaming rooms. Dudes make like four fucking videos hiding from all of his family members here, hiding from the police. Bro's gonna hide from his inner demons tonight, dude. Seems a little sketchy. That's why you're gonna go first. Uh... I'm still playing games. Now that we have our epic slide in place, we just have to hide it so the police don't find it. I hope our camouflaging skills are good. I bought all of these materials right here that we're gonna be covering the slide with so no one can tell it's a slide. And all of these ones as well. They're looking for you as you're building this whole thing. And the camouflage is aluminum foil? Tin foil? <laughs> we're gonna take these sheets and put them over that box right there so it looks like some sort of unit that would be on top of a building. We got these little vent pieces right here that we're gonna be placing on so it looks even more blended in. Aw, oh, dude, I love this game. It's so fun. Please don't scream while we're hiding from police. You're right, sorry. <laughs> Our slide is completely hidden. The police are never gonna oh, find yeah. this. Oh Shut yeah, this is completely hidden. I would never suspect. <laughs> <laughs> this dude, what am I looking at? What am I looking at, bro? Oh my God. You've just planted something in the middle of nowhere, dog. What the f They're never gonna find this. Shout out They're to Lenovo for making the best this. gaming devices in the entire world and supporting this video. Hey, Barry, I'm checking the southeast side of the corner. I haven't found anything yet. Yeah, I've been watching a few of his videos. We've seen he's pretty creative where he likes to hide. So we're trying to check a few different spots. Ah, uh, yes, the police are big fans of Matthew Beam over here. They watch every single video right on upload, of course. Yeah, that was actually insane. Speaking of insane, we give away $1,000 every week just like this. If you guys subscribe to my channel and my brand new gaming channel, Beam Gaming, I'll give you $1,000. Average age of Matthew Beam's audience right there. I subscribe to both channels. Oh my god, oh, he's he's hooked the kitties, man. He's really done it. You know he's out. He's not gonna win. We take our jobs very seriously. There's gotta be a hint of irony here, man. There's no way grown adults are sitting editing this going like, we take our jobs very seriously as the police. We're hunting a grown man in a secret gaming room. We're driving around with their sirens on, but now it's time for our light show. Let's see it. Crazy! Our security dumpster has been picking up a lot of police activity in the area, so we're gonna go and hide. Hopefully, they don't find us. 
There's police officers. You can see the police officers are right there. Bro, Cheyenne's out there in a bulletproof vest. Did they yep. search anything but this place, dude? He's wanting to climb all over this thing. I think this is our hide right here, guys. Yo. <laughs> The dog definitely smelt the cocaine on this guy, dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> Got some of that arrow in there. Let's definitely get some more units in here and lock this thing down. I think this is where he's at, Russ. This is Barry. I mean, some units north and south shut down. There's a siren. Do you hear that? <laughs> it's getting closer, too. You're a grown adult man. They're like right outside the door. Bro, bro, is, bro got oh, five stars. Is there outside. a helicopter coming? I just heard them in there. All right, Matthew, this is the Colorado Springs Police Department K-9 unit. We told you we were going to beat you at your game, and we did. I love found you. You need to put down the controller and come out with your hands up. They're literally about to put a dog inside their mat. Put down the controller. in no way, bro. You, you stay in front of me. You're, you're in front of me. <laughs> I'm you still playing Teenage dog. Mutant Ninja Turtles. I'm not coming oh, out. Nothing's so <laughs> Dear God. We got a runner. All right, you win. Watch your head. Keep sliding. Uh, yeah, yeah, season James. This is the only part of the video I like. To give away five thousand dollars, so subscribe for a chance to win and click this. Today I'm challenging my friends. Oh, I, I didn't even want to click that. I didn't even want to click that. Stop it, Matthew Beam. Stop it. Oh man, that was some form of ancient Japanese torture right there, dude. Oh my God. Getting through a single video. I, I think I'm down to my last remaining brain cell here, man. Bro, he's commented with his second channel here. Bet the police can't find me while I'm playing Minecraft. Oh my God. <laughs> Police had 18 cases of murder, but couldn't go because Matt hired them. Occupying a whole police precinct for an entire day sure as hell cost more than $5,000. I think people above the age of 10 have actually found this video now. Just became a member. Respect to what you do. Imagine the crimes that are happening, but instead these guys are paying cops to find them. Beam Gaming! Oh boy. Oh boy. Can't wait for this to- This is gonna copy Mr. Beast's gaming channel, essentially. Dude is like Mr. Beast's little aborted cousin, dude. Today I'm building a secret gaming room under my backyard to hide from my dad. My dad doesn't realize it, but every time I play video games, he bothers me. So to build a hidden gaming room without him knowing, I'm sending- This is like every kid's wet dream or something. I think that's- that's the appeal here. Today I'm building a secret gaming room under my bed to hide from my sister. My sister doesn't realize it, but she always uses my room to play video games. I guess his sister plays the role of like a Darman actor, just oblivious to everything that's going on. Of course, the recommendation is Ben Azalart over here. He's definitely in that same genre of mind numbing kids content. Today, I'm building a secret gaming room under my stairs to hide from my mom. My mom doesn't realize it, but literally every time I play video games, she interrupts me. So to build a hidden gaming room without her knowing, I'm sending her on a surprise dream vacation. Paris? Matt, no. Why would you do this? Oh. You guys are going to Paris in an hour. You need to start packing your bags right now. Are you serious? Pick up bags. Which one do you want? Imagine he's just Heisenberg. I don't know. Cooking drugs in his basement or some shit. <laughs> Maybe that's what all these secret gaming rooms are. Bro is just cooking meth or something, dude. Anyways, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go electrocute myself. <laughs> Click this video. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.